So a lot of the material that I'm talking about is material that I've presented to a bunch of medical students and college students in terms of how to interview. And I think that a lot of the material that I'm talking about is opinion. And so please, if you have an opinion about something that I say, feel free to jump in and, and talk about it. I think that your opinion is valid also. Probably not as good as mine. But, you know, that being said, no response to that? I, I, I have plenty of opinions. I share my opinions <laughs> widely. And uh, I believe in my opinions. I believe in myself. Good. And, uh, that's, that's actually a great first step um, in terms of talking about interviewing. And I think that having self-confidence is one of those things that really makes a difference. But in, interestingly enough that you sort of straightened up there, you know, one of the things that I talk about is sort of the soft sciences stuff about power posing. Have you heard about power posing? Uh, no. Uh, uh, you would keep your clothes on for that, right? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Um, but the idea is, is that if you stand in a power pose, a pose, you know, sort of the, the Superman or the Wonder Woman, um, you know, that it gives you the confidence to uh, to go in and it actually improves test scores. So so it's one of those things that I, I say it's very soft science, but that you should consider doing it and it'll build you up and give you the confidence going into an interview. And let's face it, interviews are very awkward scenarios. They're they're an artificial situation. You're talking to someone that you may have absolutely nothing in common with. Absolutely nothing. Like today. <laughs> Hopefully we have a lot in common. Oh, we'll, we'll find that. That remains to be seen. Are you kidding? I, come on. Well, you know. I love up Natalie Portman, but. Well, that, that goes without saying. Um, so with that being said, I, I think that Anything that you can do to increase your confidence is something that you want to do because it's going to make you a better interviewee and hopefully it's going to contribute to your chances of getting whatever position it is that you're applying for. So you should have a shot of something before you go in. Probably not alcohol, um, just because it's going to, first of all, smell um, and let's face it. Not vodka. <laughs> not good vodka. All right. But yeah, but be confident before you go in. Power pose. No One question. of our residents, I think, hollers or screams in the car on the way to a shift. Really? Yes. Quiet spoken resident. Is that resident a fairly good resident? Yeah. yeah. Oh, good. I, so I guess it works for them. Um, and probably not something that you need to do while the other people are watching you. No. In the car is good. Yeah. 